I don't think that you know. I'm trying hard to show. These days it's hard to tell what's on your mind. Why don't you stop pretend? Life, this is what we plan. I can see the end is coming down. And if I don't look back, will you let me get away? If I turn my back and walk, will you stay? Room to it. Okay, so when you walk in, you've got all of this view, and then we've got the bed over here Hi, with a cool little telephone, and then this fabulous pink couch, which is what sold it to me, and these cool pictures. And then the view is crazy. So we're up on the 13th floor, pretty cool. And then we've got this kitchen area and a nice little dining table. And because it's my birthday, they've left us this cute little note. Welcome to Lemon Lock. We are delighted to have you here with us to kick off your birthday celebrations. We hope you enjoy your stay. P.S. Here's some treats on us. And they've left us some sweets, all different kinds of sweets and some champagne. So we will enjoy that later. But yeah, our view is just so cool. I didn't realize there were so many tall buildings here. And then we've got our telly on the wall there and a full kitchen, so. We are now going to go to the theater. We're going to see Wicked. I'm so excited. <laughs> I've seen it before, but I had a restricted view last time. So we're going to go and have a beautiful view this time. And I cannot wait. If I turn my back in Dan has just gone down to get us some coffee and I am just staying here in the apartment and I just <clears throat> and I have just woken up you can probably tell by my face and my voice and we are just gonna chill and then we've got brunch booked in at the Ivy City Garden at 11 so we're really excited to go there but I'm just feeling so grateful to be in this apartment right now and looking at this amazing view it's just so cool. I find it so cool that like people live in these too. Like that is somebody's home. Um, like it's so high up. I mean, I don't even know if you can fully grasp how high up we are, but we are really, really high. So today we are going to the Ivy City Garden for brunch and then we are going to do some exploring not sure where we're going to go yet we tried to go to buckingham palace yesterday but because it's been the queen's jubilee weekend all of the stages were still up and you couldn't get down to it so we might try that again today um, and just see if we can see it from a different angle there's a building like straight ahead um let me show you like this one like people live in these apartments i just find it so different to what i'm used to it's crazy um i think because i am from i'm from just a small little village um in the northeast of england like this is just so different to what i'm used to it's crazy 
Um, but the apartment's so nice. Like we've got our own little kitchen and things, and they left me some little birthday treats and. We didn't drink any of the champagne or anything. We've put it in the fridge, but we might have a glass tonight. Um, but yeah, it's just so nice waking up and being somewhere different. I miss the boys though. I do miss the boys, but we're going back tomorrow, so we'll see them then. Anyway, we're going to get ready for the day, have our coffee and breakfast, and then head over to the Ivy City Garden. And we'll see what the day brings us, because we don't really have plans. We're just going to explore, which I love. So Dan is back with the goodies. I nearly didn't show you. I started eating it, but I just got the croissant and I got, uh, what is this? Caramel latte. Caramel latte. And Dan got a chocolate muffin and... A black Americano. I'm, I'm quite boring like that. <laughs> black Americano. <laughs> so yeah, we're going to enjoy this and enjoy our view. And then we're going to get ready to explore for the day. Enjoy, guys. Thank you. <laughs> we are just having a birthday brunch. I've got some apple juice, I've got a cappuccino, and I've got avocado eggs benedict on its way. I went a bit boring and just got the original but glazed. What did you get? Yeah, I got one called Freddo Mercury, which is... Freddo Mercury. Yeah, baby. Looks awesome. So we're just going to go explore Covent Garden now and maybe Trafalgar Square. because it's all so busy around here so we're right next to Big Ben it's just here um, we've got Winston Churchill behind me and then this is kind of like a green where people are just sitting it's the Houses of Parliament right? oh yeah Houses of Parliament obviously is attached to Big ben. Big ben so we just thought this is a perfect place to just sit and have our donuts so we're gonna have our donuts and just kind of take everything in and then we're gonna do some more exploring so this is mine. I just got a normal glazed donut and Dan got, what was this called? A Freddie Mercury, uh, isn't it? Yeah, Fred, Fred, Fred O Mercury. Fred O Mercury. So let's see you take your first bite. I mean, it's pretty big, isn't it? I'll go straight through the Fred O as well. Go for it. Oh my dears. <laughs> Let me see. Oh, great that though. What flavour is it? Chocolate? Mm -hmm. I'm gonna go for the glazed bite. Mm. Yeah. So we've left the chaos, we're right next to St James's Park and we're just having a nice little stroll down the street. They've still got all of the barriers up from the Jubilee celebrations. So we are heading up to Buckingham Palace now. We came yesterday, but we couldn't see much. So we're hoping that from this angle, we'll be able to see more. Yeah, so they've still got the barriers and everything up, but you can see Buckingham Palace in the distance, I'll show you. So we have stayed, we've stopped at this place called Nova in Victoria and we've just ordered some drinks. I've gone just for English breakfast tea. Dan's gone for a pint of lager. Yeah. Pint of lager. Um, it's really cute here. We came here last night for our evening meal before we went to the theatre. Um, but we're at a different bar at the moment, but same area. Um, 
so because nice. our feet are starting to hurt. Yeah, it's quite warm today, it's like 23 degrees, so pretty warm. We're just taking a little rest break. You may also notice that I'm now wearing a pink t-shirt, so I swapped. My blue one is in there because I bought this at the shop and I just loved it so much. I was like, right, I'm going to put it straight on. <laughs> We are just sitting in Hyde Park. We've got ice cream. I went mint chocolate chip and Dan went mint chocolate chip and chocolate. And we're just sitting in Hyde Park, people watching. I love people watching. But I've just been saying to Dan, I haven't seen very many children around. Where we live, this park would be full of children. When this is full of adults, couples, people reading, people just chilling, mm -hmm. not many children. Uh, like green patches of London now. People have come really utilise this bit. Well, you'd think it would bring kids as well. Mm. So anyway, we're going to finish our ice cream and then we're going to Piccadilly Circus. What's there? Shops. Lots of shops. Going to go see some shops. So we've changed our mind because there was a demonstration going on at Piccadilly so we've came to Knights Bridge instead and we're going to go have a look at Harrods because it's iconic and Zara. <laughs> on all of the underground and everything and it was just a bit overwhelming so I needed to have a break. So we're trying to debate how to get back to our hotel now and whether to go out for dinner or stay in. We're not sure. We'll see how we feel when we get back. Let me be honest. I don't know a single thing that I haven't done to make you notice me. Let me be real here. We decided to get an Uber back to our room and we're probably going to uber eat some, in some food tonight as well because we are both so tired we've done like 20,000 steps today 25,000 yesterday so we're just ready for some chill time now so we are back out we are rested and we are now exploring down here because we believe Tower Bridge is straight down this street. We spotted a nice little cinema spot, so we've turned around and we're heading back to that. It's really close to our hotel, just because our legs are aching and we figured the closer we are, the better. So we're going to go there instead of heading all the way back down there to see if Tower Bridge is there. Because we know Tower Bridge is there because we looked on the map and we saw it yesterday. Also, do you like my new jacket? We are back in our room. Dan is making a cup of tea. The place is a mess. We need to tidy it. Um, but we've just been out for tea. I had flatbread, chicken, sweet potato fries and beans. It was nice. Dan had a beef burger. And now we're just admiring the view. We're going to have a cup of tea. And then I think we're just going to watch a movie or something and chill out because my legs are so sore. So is Dan's. And we just need a rest for the rest of the night. Cut that, cut that, cut that. What did you do? My legs aren't sore. Really? Especially when you're in so's dance. My legs aren't sore. Okay. So, so I'm gonna end this vlog here and pick it back up in the morning. We're going home tomorrow just after lunch time. So we're thinking possibly of going over to Borough Market tomorrow because we wanted to do that and we haven't done that yet. And um, we want to do Borough Market in Carnaby Street. So we might do that tomorrow if we've got time. If not, we'll just have a chill day, go for breakfast, get the train home, that kind of thing. Um, but yeah, I shall see you in the morning. When I see you, my heart starts racing, but I don't know if I like this chasing and playing and waiting around. It's a shame that my hands start shaking. everyone today is sunday dan's in the shower just getting ready for the day i'm just putting on 
my makeup then I need to sort out this hair and um, we're not sure what to do today because obviously we didn't think but we're going to have to have our suitcase with us wherever we go so we don't really want to go anywhere particularly busy and yesterday it was so busy um towards Leicester Square Piccadilly Circus all that type of stuff so we might actually just stay around here go get some breakfast and then have a look around some of the shops and then head over to King's Cross but I'll take you along with us wherever we go anyway okay so we are just about to leave our lovely room i'm so sad to leave this pink couch i just love this pink couch i'm gonna go get some breakfast probably head down towards tower bridge and get our last little london fix before we go home yeah. <laughs> We've just asked at the front desk and they said it's a 15, 20 minute walk to Tower Bridge if we head down this road. So we were going to do it last night, but we ended up staying around here because there was so many cool places to eat and stuff. So now we're going to actually head down to Tower Bridge. Even though we did it the other day, I think that's been our favourite spot so far in London. So we're going to spend the morning down there. You hang around when you don't have to. There's so much that I'm still keeping to myself because you don't live My heart starts racing, but I don't know if I like this chasing and playing and waiting around. It's a shame that my hands start shaking all of the time when you're around me. But this time, this time. Wondering who lives in that penthouse right on the River Thames, right next to Tower Bridge. Must cost a fortune to live up there. So we're just FaceTiming the boys and Dan's shown them the bridge, Tower Bridge, and he's shown them all the sights. So lots of influencers along here getting professional photography taken. Must be a hot spot for it. This time, this time. Girl, I know what's bothering me. I need somebody to
Say hi, Ryan. Hi, Ryan. <laughs> <laughs> Mom. Yeah. I'm boss your phone. I'm Brenda. Just to pull that back to us. Pull that back there. Ha, 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 ha.